Hi guys, let's take a look at this question. We are given that the average mass of a group of boys was 34.5 kg. Okay, so let's put down what we know. Then, we are also given that Dave's mass was 40.5 kg. Okay, and when Dave joined the group, okay, what happened? The average mass became 36 kg. So, we are supposed to find how many boys were there in the group at first. So, in order to solve this question, we need to make use of what we know okay, and work towards what we don't know. In this case, we know the original average mass of the group of boys, correct? Okay, it's 34.5. And then we also know the new average mass. So, the first thing that we need to do is actually to find the difference in the average mass. Okay, and we do that by taking 36 minus 34.5 which gives us an answer of 1.5. So far, so good. Then what's the next step? We are given that this mass was actually 40.5 kg, correct? So here we have the average mass of the boys, okay? But in actual fact, Dave is one of the boys, correct? And this mass was 40.5 kg. So in order for this average mass to become 36, right? We will actually need to distribute his extra mass to the other boys, correct? So let's find that amount of extra mass that is being distributed, okay? We can do that by taking 40.5, which is this mass, minus 36, which is the average mass. And this would give us a value of 4.5 kg. So in other words, we know that this 4.5 kg has to be distributed among the boys, correct? And we know that as a result of Dave being included, the average mass actually increases by 1.5 kg. So in order to find the number of boys at first, all we need to do is to take okay, 4.5 divided by 1.5 and this would give us the answer of 3. Okay, I hope this video has helped you in terms of understanding. Okay, Thank you for watching. If you have any other questions, please feel free to leave them in the comments below and I'll be more than happy to answer them. Okay, bye.